What's going on YouTube? This video is just going to be a video about uh, some things that I picked up at Blockbuster and uh, you know to say my final goodbye to Blockbuster because as many of you know uh, they're going out of business and it's coming up soon. So the title will probably be like rest in peace Blockbuster or something but there's a lot of good sales going on right now at Blockbuster so I'm going to show you guys that. Before I show you guys what I got, um, basically I've been getting some feedback that I haven't been posting enough videos, um, which I'm really trying to, to do my best on posting videos. It just, I don't want to keep posting videos that you guys aren't really going to care about. Like, I, see, OK Chief, uh, I'm a big fan of his. He, he, uh, really helped me start off my channel because I was getting some dumpster dive videos. But, um, he, uh, does, like, these, uh, unbox like, these mystery unboxing videos, which I, I love and enjoy watching, and, um, so, ba basically, uh, that, that would be a way that I could, uh, make a lot more uploads without, you know, ha having it still be interesting, and he also does, like, Game Chaser stuff, which is really cool, too, but, anyways, if anyone's interested in, uh, in sending the package and, watch me unbox it uh just just personal message me just go to uh click on my channel click about and then click send message and uh and yeah we can work something out and that's it for that it, that's just if you want to be featured in one of my videos like okay chief 420 does and uh back when i was first starting my channel i uh there's this guy named head above water three he made uh game star dumpster dive videos he was uh he's one of the two people i watched him and okay chief and, uh, he took down his channel, but I, I sent him a gift package, uh, back when I had, like, 50 subscribers or something, because I thought his, his like, it would be so cool, because he had, like, 2,000 subscribers, I'm like, that'd be the coolest thing, you know, to watch him make a video of him unboxing my package, like, that's really cool, but that's just me. But, uh, anyways, now on to what you guys, uh, were looking for, is the actual Blockbuster finds. So, I'm gonna save what's in this crate... Uh, last, you guys may have been able to tell, may not have, but, uh, first I got this bag full of, uh, cases, it's all Wii, Xbox 360, or 3DS cases, and yeah, that's just the case, as is, uh, this, uh, only PS3 case I got there, um, so yeah, that's it for that, um, in here, let's see, I don't even know what they put in, the each bag, so, I got season five of The Office, all uh, all five discs for ninety nine cents, so that's pretty cool. All the seasons are a uh, dollar each, and I'm not sure if they put them in this box, but sometimes they don't have complete uh, seasons. And um, my store manager of um, my Blockbuster, he uh, he said I could pick out like four or five and uh, that like random see like like each one of these uh, for random movie or random show sorry about that and uh price it as a dollar and also all movies and uh blu-rays every single one is uh 99 cents each except the new and sealed ones like uh the ones that you buy at target those are still uh those are 70 percent off so then i got um these are the two movies i got uh blu-ray paranormal activity i never seen the first one uh, I figured it'd be worth a dollar, and uh, I was recommended this, uh, The Final Break, Prison Break, it's a m movie off the TV show, so, um, alright, also I got, uh, they just had a few things of candy, and they're not much, but they're like 20 cents each, so I got those, then uh got some video games here, I think almost all these are video games, or at least should be, uh, all the video games are 80% off the listed price, which is a really good deal. Uh, so, I'll show you guys what I got. Um, I think $15, uh, I forget the list, I, I left the receipt in my car. But, uh, I think this was like $3, this was like a dollar, this was $4, $4, which was really cool for Wii U games. I mean, obviously this is just Madden 13, but... Um, four dollars for a Wii U game. I was very, very happy to get that. And then, uh, Tekken, I, I don't know how much I'm going to play this, but for four dollars, and I just got a Wii U, have some games to play on it, that was really cool. 
got Darkness 2. That must have been like $4. Dead Island Riptide was like $3.50. I don't even know why I opened up the case. Um, this, I just got this because, uh, they just had a few, like, they probably had like 30 of these. Um, not that many good titles. I just wanted the Blu-ray case for a dollar. This was like, uh, $6, I believe, for, uh, XCOM. I got, like, uh, XCOM the Brew or something like that, uh, but I'd never had that one. Now, this one doesn't have the actual, uh, uh, cover art in it. I'm hoping I'll be able to come across it, but, um, got that game for, like, $3 or something. And this game looked kind of cool. It was only, like, 4 bucks, so I couldn't go wrong with that. And then the rest should be movies, I'm pretty sure. Um, this was uh, 99 cents for uh, Curb Your Enthusiasm, the complete seventh season. Uh, I know it's uh, based off Seinfeld, and I, I really enjoy Seinfeld, so I thought I'd try this out for a dollar. Um, let me see if I can pull some of these out in here. All right, now all these are like loose. These are this. This is what I was telling you about. Like basically, it was like four for a dollar in these. So these were like a quarter each, because they're just uh, certain discs from uh, like uh, various TV shows. So uh, this is uh, obviously you guys will be able to see. It, but I got some Family Guy. Uh, one of my substitute teachers. I was talking to him uh, yesterday in class, and he uh, he highly recommended uh, The Wire to check that out. So, for a quarter to, you know, see what it's about, I thought, why not? Um, got some more Family Guy. Uh, The Wire. I was recommended to watch 30 Rock. A lot of these I probably would not have, got, like, have gotten, but they were a quarter each, so I thought, why not? Uh, more Prison Break. I think I almost got a complete season of the Prison Break. Maybe missing one disc. But, um, yeah, more Prison Break at The Office Season 1. And then got some another Office, and then uh, Prison Break. Now, this was my um, uh, best find, probably, because this is really, really cool. I think you guys will be uh, just as interested in this than I was. But, um, first, almost... I. Like, they had so many of these left, I didn't grab, I grabbed a lot, um, but I didn't grab all of them. They have, like, uh, these blockbuster cards, like, cardboard cards that, uh, they use for display. So I just grabbed a random stack of them to see, I, I didn't really care, I just saw, like, uh, you know, the cards for video games, and they had movie ones of these, too, if anyone wanted movie ones. But, uh, yeah, I got, like, Pokemon, Black and White, and... And these can be used for, like, uh, craft stuff or, like, insert if you want to use it as an insert. Because uh, it looks just like the actual cover arts. And uh, I was hoping with some of these Wii ones I get more Mario, but I guess that's Wii Party. Um, oh, Portal 2, that's cool. But, yeah, I don't even know which ones I got. This looks like Super Mario Galaxy 2, which it is, so that's cool. Um, Golden Eye. So now, I saw this box, and I was there the other day, and I, I saw this box, but I didn't really care to look what was inside of it. But, uh, I'm, I'm glad I waited, because, oh, I didn't even mention at the beginning of the video, uh, but uh, all the blockbusters close this, uh, Sunday, uh, January 13th, maybe, because today's Friday, Friday the 10th, so, um... It, Maybe it would be the 12th. I, I'm not sure. But it closes this Sunday. I'm going to upload this video on Friday. So, uh, yeah. So, basically, what's inside here are actual cover arts that they pulled out from, like, their rented games because they print out their own copies. So, I got a ton of official cover arts, like, um, actually really good ones, like Super Mario Bros. Um, I was looking through some Nintendo DS ones. And these are actually uh, alphabetized, which... They decided to keep in alphabetical order, which is really cool. Um, Pokemon Pearl, Spyro, um, some other random game. I wonder if they have like, Pokemon Heart Gold. Because I know that one is pretty desirable. But So that's some DS ones. I'm not going to go through all these, obviously. But got a ton of PS2 ones, which 
at this point, you know, like, PS2 ones aren't easy to come by, uh, for certain games. So, got a lot of PS2 there, got a lot more here, Jack and Daxter, Lego, got Brett Favre news on the Jets, which, that wasn't for a long time. Um, yeah, so got PS2, more PS2, which, well, like I said, I, unfortunately, I don't know what they did with the manual, um, they may have pitched them, I'm not sure, but, uh, but, it, it comes with the cover art, the official one, which is probably the most desirable. And I don't know if I mentioned the price, how much I paid for this, but it was uh, $10 total for the entire box with all of these. Which actually, if you just wanted to buy these and say you couldn't, this box w wasn't at your local blockbuster, uh, the cards right now are 100 for a dollar. So you shouldn't, you, you can get a lot of those for really cheap. So those are some PSP ones. Um... I don't know what that is, just run that. Um, PlayStation 3, Saints Row 2, Spider-Man, some Tiger Woods, Dark Kingdom. I wonder if they have uh, a Tom Clancy one that I needed. Transformers, Skate, Tomb Raider. So that's cool. Got Little Big Planet. Um, that's actually just one of the cutouts. From the thing I got. Ratchet and Clank. Need for Speed Undercover. Actually, I need to find a Need for Speed on, uh, what you call it? Carbon for PS3. I, I'm missing that. So, um, got some more PS3 ones in there. Don't want to go through every single one. But, um, huh, they actually, they actually had that this exact game there for like a dollar that I didn't get. And, but it didn't have the cover art, so I might go back up there uh, tomorrow or something and pick it up. Uh, Super Mario Galaxy. Let's see what else. More Wii. Legend of Zelda, that's cool. Well, this looks like it comes with the manual for uh, Kirby's uh, Dream Collection. It's a good manual to have. And there's the actual uh, cover art for it, so that that's a cool bundle there. Um, looks like actually there's quite a few uh, manuals for the Wii. But, yeah, more we Animal Crossing. Wait, so, yeah, this is, uh, very cool if you can come across this. Like I said, I for $10 and he took it. Um, so, yeah, I want to go through my collection, see if, uh, see what cover arts I need, get them, and, uh, and yeah, this is this is always going to be nice to have, uh, so I can go through whenever I need to and uh, use it. So yeah, that's about it. Just uh, some Xbox 360 uh, cover arts left, which I'm at this point I think I'm getting kind of boring with it. But yeah, that's what's inside this, all in alphabetical order, which is really good because if you guys recall, I I have found like a big box of uh, of cover arts in the dumpster from GameStop. However, those were just promotional cover arts, which weren't the actual official cover arts, um, which, I, I mean, promo cover arts are nice uh, to use it better than printing one out, but to have the actual ones that came in the game, uh, I feel $10 was a great, great buy, because I don't even know, there has to be, like, quite a few hundred in here. So yeah, uh, I didn't. I tried to make this video short so it'd be quicker to upload, so you guys could get on these deals quicker. But, um, but yeah. So that's about gonna be it for the video. Just uh, yeah, if if you guys want to be featured in one of my videos and uh, be uh, there's already one person who, who has messaged me um, about a uh, gift, like it, you, you know, like uh, the gift mystery unboxing videos. There's already one. I don't know if he shipped it yet. He said he was gonna ship it today. I haven't asked him if he did yet, but, um, yeah, so I, I would love to start that series up, uh, planning on getting a P.O. box soon, but, uh, for now, if you're interested in, uh, sending one, I'll give you an address to ship to, and, yeah, so that is it for the video, and if you like the video, just hit the thumbs up button down below, and as always, thanks for watching, and have a great day.